Ringo was born July 13th, 2002, or thereabouts. Um, I picked him up as a birthday present to myself at the end of August in 2002. He was a cute guy with a little blaze head. How could I not want him? Right away, Jake, of course, took an interest to him, as he does to all the babies. <laughs> Come on out! And Ringo took an interest to the rubber buttons on the remote controls. Here he is with Oliver. Look how dark Oliver is back then, and how tiny Ringo is. And you can see the reason I named him wasn't for Ringo Star, but because of the little ring on the base of his tail. My, what big teeth you have. Ah! My, what bad breath you have. Yeah, well, I'll kick your ass. Here he is snuggled up with Freddy. Actually, I think he was sleeping, and Freddy was messing with him, and he was just out cold. And I was giving soup to Teddy, and his eyes just kind of opened up like, hmm. Here he is, just looking cute. That's a still off the video. Look how tiny he was. He was such a cute little tiny thing. There he is, trying to relax. Just <laughs> a cute little face. <laughs> a little pounce mode there. Hello down there. Again, having trouble relaxing. I like that one because he's got a big old lip. Grr. Yeah, I'm cute, so? Of course, just like other baby ferrets, he's uh, finds skin a little bit tasty. There he is, looking sweet as can be. I like this one because his rear end's off the ground. And the water droplet frozen as he's playing in the tub. Got kind of a punk rock look about him there. And shaking the water off. And looking like a little badass all wet. And this is because Jake was leaning over the tub. Man, that was a nasty tub. <laughs> nice grout. <laughs> anyway, there's Jake looking at him like, What you doing, little ferret? And he used to climb into everything. In fact, he still does. Here he is in my purse. Rah! The monster of the purse. Here he is taking a little chomp out of Luna Kitty's ear. And again, having trouble relaxing. Just looking cute. Nice little lick pick. Here's where he stole the Jeep and went out joyriding. You can see how big he's getting. This is about when he was at his biggest. Very fat and fluffy. Look at that fat little face. <laughs> Holding a little ping pong ball in his paws in the laundry basket. Got kind of a spike do going like to chow down on Jake's food. Still does. At least now he grabs the food and runs. He used to just sit in Jake's bowl. And he, uh, this is him helping me rearrange the uh, Xbox games. I think that's Duncan in the foreground. I uh, can't really tell. Might be Teddy. But here he is, coming out of the tube. And a little bit upside down. And here he is. I think that's one of the funniest pictures of him. Just that little splotchy nose. And his ears are just kind of too big, aren't they? And here he is, passed out cold, obviously having sweet dreams. Look how big his belly is at this point. And here he is as Ferenzilla. This is one of the hottest days last summer, and I couldn't find him in Oliver, and then found him in the closet floor in this perfect little X. I thought it was so cute. And there he is in the bass drum. It's funny, I'll play the drum, and he goes, uh, comes running... <clears throat> it kind of gives his Ringo dual meaning there for Ringo Starr. Here he is attacking, I believe it is Andy, and holding the Christmas ornament, and doing this tuck and scoot. Here's him completely airborne, not a foot on the ground. Uh, yeah, okay, that's the same picture as before. I think I need to edit this. And here he is with uh, on my futon, on my pillows. Again, with that silly little polka dot nose. He's just got the cutest little nose. Lazing about in the hammock. Stretch! What you looking at? And here he is, just looking like a rag doll. He's trimmed down, like they always do as babies. They seem to get so fat, and then they trim on down. And here he is now, lounging with his buddy Oliver, 
It's interesting. Oliver lightened up, and Ringo pretty much stayed the same as far as the color went. <laughs> they look a lot light. Looked a lot alike for a while there, but now they look really different. They both kind of got splotchy noses, though. And there he is, taking a big old yawn and saying, "Okay, enough of the story. I'm going to bed."